village of Akulovic, population 600, woke up to a commotion. One resident looked out his window and saw 19-year-old Ilutak Anutuk. There was a bloody knife and uh, I had to hide myself. At some point, Anutuk posted to Facebook saying he stabbed five people and I just don't care if I killed someone else. Police say Anutuk broke into three houses before they shot and killed him down the block. My girlfriend went outside. She opened the door. There was a, a body, bloody body, lying on the doorstep. It was Eli Kanujuak, who along with Anutuk's aunt and her son, had been stabbed. Kanujuak died of his wounds. The others are recovering in a Montreal hospital. Police also say Anutuk killed his uncle and young cousin. The tight-knit Inuit community is in shock and mourning. Anutuk's former teacher Randy McLeod says his student had a tragic past. His mother was murdered and his brother committed suicide. It's very unfortunate what he did, but at the same time, the lack of resources that are available to all Inuit who are taxpaying citizens in Canada, it's quite embarrassing on the part of the government. Quebec Premier Philippe Couillard addressed that criticism. We know that social issues among the Inuits and First Nations in general, but Inuits in particular, are very, very significant. And we are working very, very hard to improve that. Provincial police are now trying to find out what happened to set this family tragedy in motion, a tragedy that's shaken the entire community. Simon Nakaneshny, CBC News, Montreal.